If you're using Ajax cameras, great news. Inside your mobile app, there was an update for an AI notification. That means that every Ajax camera that you have, you will now receive AI notification directly on your phone. So if your camera records a pet, a vehicle, or human, you receive this on your mobile app, and this way it will reduce an enormous amount of false alarm. So in this video, we'll look at this, how to program it inside your mobile app, and we'll show you all the details to make sure it works 100%. But before we start, in a couple of weeks, guys, it's the special event from Ajax. It's the multiverse. We're really excited here because at every special event, Ajax releases new products. So for their old solution, last year, we got the video surveillance that we have right there. And as you can see, it just keeps on improving. So this year it's on November 21st, and I believe it starts at 1 p.m. on EST, so in the Montreal time zone. So stay tuned, but right now, let's dive into this update. All right, so go inside your Ajax application and keep in mind that any video surveillance from Ajax, so whether it's the NVR or the camera, it's a standalone product. So you don't need a hub to have this work. You can even have just the camera with an SD card inside of it, and this way you will be able to receive the AI notifications. So when you are inside your application, all you need to do is go inside your camera. So mine is in an NVR right now. I click on the cogwheel on the top right, again on the cogwheel and you will see here there is a new uh, feature that is called notification from camera detectors so that's what you need to click on on this we will activate for pet vehicles and humans as you can see you can choose also the interval for the reporting so if you're in a busy area maybe it's better to change that time to a higher type of minutes here we'll leave it to 30 seconds so we can show you in a live demo how it works next is the notification terms so either you want to receive these notifications only when your camera is armed or always. So at all time you will receive them. Again, remember you can arm your camera with nighttime or just using your application. But before we go into deep and show you the demo, I want to talk about some specific settings you need to respect. So inside the app, when you go inside detection, make sure object detection is triggered. And inside the settings, well, you have human detection, pet detection and vehicle detection also toggled so this way you're sure to get any type of action and last but not least you remember privacy zones so this is something where you can actually build a privacy inside of your screen like right here if i configure a privacy zone i can draw a rectangle like this so if i put it in the middle of my screen well i might not receive any notifications because i'm blocking the action in the middle so make sure you don't have any privacy zones if you want to receive these types of notification. And guys, you're the installer, you're the one that knows how this is properly installed because now it's not the you know best type of situation to demo it, but when it's installed at the right height, with the right angle, you will reduce the false alarm by a ton. All right, let's jump into the live demo. So for this demonstration, we have a new guest on our show. So Oleg that is behind the camera will walk in front of the turret cam from Ajax and we will receive a notification on my phone right here. Let's roll Oleg. So as you can see here on my phone, I receive a notification for human detection and I click on it. And as you can see here, it leads me to the timeline of the turret cam and I am directly on the human detection. We have Oleg walking on the screen right here and well, you have your AI detection and AI notification. The way to find them, so this is maybe not obvious to you, is when you go back in the main section, on the bottom of your screen you have notification, and here you have the new tab video. So inside video, you have all your detections that happen on your camera. So here we have a bunch of human detected. It would be exactly the same one if you have a pet detection or a vehicle detection. So that's basically how this new feature works. So some of you might think that, well, a lot of VMS already have that function. 
but keep in mind that this is part of the Ajax ecosystem. So now you have video surveillance that can work with your alarm system and you can do a lot of things with that. And that's what makes this solution unique. For example, you can create video scenarios. This is something we'll discuss in the next videos we'll record on this series. And this is just one fraction of the possibility with the Ajax system itself. Now, guys, I mentioned at the start, special event is coming up. You have the virtual link inside our description and on my wish list, because again, every special event, they release new products. And we talked about this in previous video when the video surveillance were released. So the NVR and the camera, I'm wishing for an NVR with PoE ports. So leave us in the comment below what kind of product you would like to see Ajax release in the next special event. Again, November 21st, 1 p.m. Montreal time zone. And guys, we'll see each other in the next one.